birthday boy. No wonder you couldn't hear me. Is that your new tape? Star-Lord? Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm-hmm. Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. I gotta beat Janie's high score. This is embarrassing. It's pretty crazy that all that destruction started from one little mistake. Three natural ones in a row last game? Some barn I turned out to be. Keep hitting those dingers, George, and you'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. Might as well just peel the stickers off and put them in the right spot. Fingers are still cramped from trying to bookmark pages. I know that's not how you're supposed to play, but I'm tired of dying everywhere. The movie was okay. The soundtrack really kicked butt. Peter Quill, wake up. Holy crap, Drax. You gotta stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin our mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. I make no promises.
Oh, it ain't just a junkyard. The quarantine zone's the biggest pile of galactic war debris in the known universe. Just think of all the tech we can find. I am Groot. Hey, it's only illegal if Novacore finds us inside, which they won't. Groot's right to be nervous, Rocket. Don't underestimate the Novacore. I am Groot. Oh, come on. Am I the only one who ain't scared of the galactic police? They've got the numbers on us. But they ain't got the brains. Ha! I am Groot. Sure takes a genius to catch my ship. My ship? Who said that? Quell! No, I, I think I heard him. Nah, never mind. Almost 20 years, and those tracks are still fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. You remember that dealer who asked me? Wish you were here, Mom. After you left, he... <laughs> he leans over to me, and he says, Uh, w w what do you need these for, then? I am Groot. <laughs> yeah, like I'm turning the Milano into a dance club or something. Club of dance. Yeah, yeah, we all know how you feel about dancing. I am Groot. Well, what was I supposed to tell him? Uh, you know, I, uh... Ah, oh, there you are, Quill. Tell Groot to stop worrying about getting arrested. I am Groot. I'm not overconfident. I'm just the right level of confident. <sighs> arrested? If they catch us, they'll shoot us on spot. <gasps> Out here, on the frontier, cops don't have time to arrest people. I am Groot. <laughs> Relax, bud. Novacore ain't the type to shoot first. Arresting folks is their whole thing. That and silly helmets. <sighs> Rocket! Did you bring back the docking chips you took from the alignment console? I'll do it as soon as I reconfigure them! You better not try to sell them off! Not like I'd make any money! Things are so cheap they couldn't align two magnetized connectors. So, Drax, excited to meet our buyer after we catch the monster? Of course! Lady Hellbender is a legendary warrior, and a noble queen. And she's rich. Not so sure about tooth cleaning tablets. Manual brushing is where it's at. Wonder if Drax was allowed to decorate his cell in the kiln. Probably not. Soon discuss the status of my official team membership badge. Drax! Once again, there is no official badge! <laughs> Obviously, you would not have one, Assassin. The small one indicated the procedure is a well-guarded secret. Gizmo's rocket. I'm calling him Thumpers on account of the noise they make. Assuming we get past the force field and reach your coordinates in one piece, all we gotta do is set him up, and these babies are gonna draw out our monster in no time. <laughs> How's that even gonna work? The thumper goes beep, 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 and the monsters come running? Eh, it goes more like, uh, wah, wah, wah! Holla, rocket! Stop this rocket at once! <laughs> and then the monster comes a running out of its hole. 
Are you sure about that? Hey, all my intel came from your source. My sources are very reliable. Those coordinates are 100% pointing towards a rare, elusive, priceless creature. With no physical description to go by. What do you think elusive means? It don't matter what the monster looks like. As long as it's got ears, you could be sure my thumpers are gonna drive it right into our arms. This moment of quiet reminds me of the legendary siege of... Oh, not again. Lady Hellbender held her breath through ten moons while riding across the stars on the back of a great horned beast. And when she when arrived... When she arrived, she exhaled, and the wind blew away the Shatari. Indeed, it did. If he realized it didn't make no sense, he wouldn't be telling it. Mora? Up here, Peter. Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. Ah. It's one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done strategizing, Feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Okay, here we go. Rocket crew tracks, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Novacore security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. And if we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Novanet still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the Assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the Betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal coordinates and our ship's hard-coded serial into a local number generator. Info gets in, digits come out. Four of them. Yeah. Are you having difficulties, Peter Quill? Zero, four, five, one. Two, two, one, eight. No. Do not confuse him, Rodent. There. There was so much stuff left after the war. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overhaul. Plus, there's good money in it. The beast that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoff 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. Friend. For a night? 
And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Groot, Quill, suit up. Team Rocket's up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the Assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it, and my skin is not green. It is teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop site. Ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, Groot. Don't worry. Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. Thumper one, done. Mora, take care of my baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. <laughs> he is not a better shot than me. What, Pinku? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. I heard Novacore once wanted to cover entire planets in Novanet, just like this place. I am Groot. Hostile ones, I guess. I am Groot. Yeah, I wouldn't want the world mind picking and choosing. Most of my favorite planets would probably become jails. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... Pink goo. Ebrium-based nano-resin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Thousands of worlds fighting for some fleeting greater good. Oh, look! Yellow and blue! Looks like an old Novacore frigate. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy! Why'd he even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so... Don't know if you noticed, Rocket, but people aren't exactly falling over themselves to hire us. Oh, I have noticed. If this job pans out, sure we'll get money, but also a rich new client. We need to impress Lady Hellbender- Whoa! Okay! Ha! You almost made yourself a very late war casualty. You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us, hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you-know-who joined us. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Careful on that thing, Quill. You spot something out there? Everybody keep an eye out for any good scrap or components. Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on! How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Group, you think we could find pieces of the Triant? Oh, you happy, Quill? You found the thing. I told you was there, but you didn't listen. That's it. Walk of sh- <sighs> Of course he could know. I told him. Done gloating? 
Oh, I am never done gloating. I am Groot. Yep, classic me. It is strange. I have not encountered any corpses in the wreckage. Hmm. Probably got disintegrated. The atmosphere accelerates decon. Oh, uh. Nice splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the Flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm Groot. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit used to be. Well, that's grim. I'm Groot. Uh, yeah, try not to think about it. It's better not the one. I should have been recording. Bring over Groot. I want to see if he's alive. I am Groot. I don't know, but he's twitching. Flarkin, Scott Stain, Quill. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... Thought I saw a shortcut. Shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a crapped out Novacore missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Okay. Crawling through creepy old ship. No big deal. Easy there, Quill. Pretty sure nothing's gonna jump out at you. Except maybe me and Groot. Now this brings back memories. All right, Team Rocket, we've just set up another couple of thumpers. All you do is fly the ship. Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die! Aw, hey little guy. What are you- <laughs> Floor. You dead, Quill? We can hear your wussy squeal even without the car. Little busy! Popped another one! Quill! Hurry, your fat Huey butt up! Yeah, Peter! It's so jiggly! Ah, the hallmark of a slot! That's cheating! You guys should have seen that. It was this weird blobby thing. <laughs> Not falling for this again. It's his fault for falling. Sorry to burst your bubble! Mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. 
Like you could even tell if she had an honest face. If we set up all these thumpers and no monster shows, we'll just need to salvage what scrap we can and haul it back with us. Just trust me on... Are you kidding me? Son of a smack! That was too close! You okay, Groot? Quill? We're fine, but we can't jump that. You don't gotta jump. There's a sturdy support beam on this side. Get Groot to grow a bridge across. Just ask him nice like. He does it for me. I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear that? All right, Groot. Let's see that cool oh, That's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. Ah, oh, they're everywhere. All right. Back to business. Let's go. Boom. Right under your nose, Quill. This place really makes you wonder. About what? What Novacore hoped to do by sweeping all this up and forgetting about it. Maybe they just wanted to move on. We gotta go that way. Across the gap. Somehow. How do we know the monster we're looking for ain't one of these things we already killed? Hey, Greenies, you see any blue and gold ships out there, you'll let us know. We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we'll restrain them until we're done here. Bad idea. Those cops are all connected through their stupid helmets. If you see cops, you get my ship out of here. Even if it means leaving us behind. Ah, uh, flark that! Trust me, I've dealt with Nova Corps before, even helped them catch real criminals. I can talk my way out. You think that Milano can outrun a fully powered Nova Centurion? I agree. Okay, here we go. Alright, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No! No! Flark and Skaggy! Attack and batteries fried, that's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. The solution's a new battery, with a charge. Okay, we're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I finish scraping the fried wires. Found something with a charge. Kinda looks like a spacey car battery. Okay, this thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is... minuscule. At best. You'll be fine. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, give it short circuit! The short circuit! Looks like it's all us, Groot! Bye bye, little guy! They're really coming out of the woodwork! These thumpers have got to be a rude wake up call! Good! Use that fear! Kill them all! Like fish in a barrel! Thanks for the heads up, bud! From that missile, Groot! If that thing was gonna blow, it happened already! Ugh! It's like pop 
open to see it! Just keep swaying those branches! Done! We're all plugged in! Wow! Just in time! I'd like to see you fix it next time! Come on! Two down, two to go! that passive, bud. Quill! We found a way out! I'm Groot. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? Guys, we deliver this monster to Lady Hellbender, we'll get bigger payouts, and jobs that don't suck. A ship for each one of us! I mean, a team only needs one ship. Man! <laughs> That thing is ridiculous. Think it was a ship or a robot? That's a Cree Century. A robot, but it would have been space worthy. I'm Groot. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. Impressive, but I can fly circles around something that big. Give me a fast and sexy M Class scout over those things any day. I do appreciate that sweet Ravager pirate tech. She's made for hidden runs. And boy, can she run. She can hit, too. There's always room for more firepower, Quill. That sentry probably took on whole fleets. This whole Kree tech gets me wondering, where would I be now if those blue butt scots managed to keep me locked into their half-world experiments? I'm Groot. Yeah, <laughs> can't start you be climbing up the bits of me right now. I wasn't even a person to the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. <laughs> the entire facility was the problem. Get a load of this, Rocket! Blown it up before the end of the war. Don't worry, I ain't even gotten serious. <laughs> Tathians have no need for surnames. What about the Destroyer? It is a moniker to mark the countless I slaughtered during a shameful period of untempered rage. Yeah, one of those! I could be Rocket the Ruthless. Cause I'm pretty sure I ain't never had no Ruth. Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. <laughs> now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Yes! I'm about to win this bat quill! So, Rex, how come you're so in love with this Hellbender League? I do not love Lady Hellbender. Yeah, shouldn't you be all like, her name is not but you cannot bend hell. That is not all for some Here goes nothing. <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head. You have robot parts inside your head. It rocket scores! Ooh.
Hey, Groot, what do you think I should do when I win this bet? I mean that the units he'll owe me once I win. <laughs> well, I know what I'll be doing with my winnings. I'm saving up for our next stop on Contraxia to get one of those Zeronian massages. Ugh. Don't congratulate him! Let's see. When I beat Quill... ...tating hyper circuits. Boo! No one knows what those are! Found a nest! Maybe this is the Parasite Clubhouse! You know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. Then lose the second pistol. All right, Bumper goes there, Quill. Hey, and install itself. I'm not gonna run after you. Get that thumper over here! It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Rocket! I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started! Gotta love that kill radius! I know, right? What was that worth? Five points? Oh, come on! You can't just give yourself points like that! Sure I can! Hey, green team! Looks like we're done installing our thumpers! Great job. We'll meet you at the mining ship. All this firepower. Now it's all just scrap. <laughs> Yeah. Sorry, bud. Sorry about what? It's a fight. Old Daston Planet was torched at the start of the war. Of course it's secure. As secure as a broke down Shatari shipwreck's ever gonna be.
Yes! The resin can hold a stupid warship! <laughs> I'm telling you, it's totally safe. See? I'll even prove it. Huh? Look at this. <gasps> Rocket? Oh, Flark. Guys, jump! Piece of moldy driftwood, you could have died saving me! I love you too, you selfless son of a chug. Come on, cool. He says I'll meet us at the mining ship. I don't want to make him wait. That's it? We're not going after him? He says it's fine. We'll meet him later. Team Rocket, is everything okay? Root signal just went dark. Flark. His radio must have broke when he fell. What happened to your timber companion? He ain't timber. He's alive. He fell. I, I really don't know if you're being clever or dumb right now. Team Rocket, out. Uh, sounds like Green Team's off our backs. Now we can stop worrying about that uh, dumb accident. Groot's fine anyways. There's nothing to worry about. Whatever, right? Like you said, Groot's fine. Everything is... Fine. Exactly. We're all fine. Sure, sure. Fine. Ugh. Am I the only one who's fed up with how much this entire junkyard stinks? Man! If that afterburner kicked on right now, we'd be toast. Crap. This turbine's right in the way. Gotta get through it. These things open up to let gas through, right? Yep. You saying we're the gas? Today we are, if we can get it open. There's a drone access tunnel over here. Too bad we don't got a drone. Can you squeeze in there? Knew it. Rocket, fix the thing. Rocket, clean up the mess. Rocket, crawl into the mystery hole. See anything? Yeah, a man. Team Rocket, we hit a snag. One of our cover points was covered in resin, so we're gonna fly around and scout another spot. Just make sure the new spot as close as possible to the original one. Because of... Mass and Great, another turbine. Yeah, that is how these things are usually built. And someone's been practicing. Imagine towing all this scut by hand. Come on, let's get out of here. On the next mission, I do not wish to be on green team. We're back on track. The mining ship ain't too far. Think Groot's already ahead of us? Maybe. Oh crap, 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 crap! It wasn't me this time, I swear! I don't like this! <laughs> point for me! That point don't count before dead! Oh crap! <laughs> Where is Ow! Larkin, son of a! I told you I saw them. Great timing! How did you guys- Good to see you two. We're gonna want to cross the ship as fast as you can. We're seeing a lot of movements. Yeah, Scott's getting real violent out here. Uh, just try to hold her still for us. That's not gonna be an option soon. This position is untenable. Drax says hurry it up, Peter. Incoming! Watch out! What? That's not going to be an option soon! This position 
and cozy in here. Not so much when you can't see in the dark. Ah, I think I felt the panel. Yeah, there's wiring in there. I'll see if I can get the systems back on. How long is this gonna take? Oh, come on! Larkin tensor joint! Just neat! Uh, wiggle the... Uh. Okay, so life support's booting back up. What's it look like out there? Oh, mother of space ball. Well, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, it's just... Man. Swarm of old cleaner bots. Maybe. Old cleaner bots. I don't know. Okay, buddy. <sighs> Sorry about the shooting. Yeah, thought you were that freaky thing we accidentally released. Saw! We saw some cleaner bots. <laughs> accidentally. At a distance. I am good. We're totally all right. They just ran away when it saw us, right, Quill? Rocket, I'm not so sure that swarm thing was inoffensive. I feel kind of bad about releasing it. I am good. Quill took a pot shot at this massive worm nest. A chunk of something fell off, and the big floaty creature came. Hang on a tick. I am 
There you go. Rendezvous coordinates are that way. But we'll have to find a way around the rubble. I'll try to find a side passage. Look at this old beauty. I am Groot. A table! This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear? Hey, hand me that part. Ain't nothing spooky. It's an old ship is all. And dark, sure. Hey, Quill! Groot says there might be something behind the big unit over here! On it, and finished! Doing, doing, done! Hey, Groot. <laughs> yeah, there's a way through, if we can clear out that crud. Yeah, that's one stubborn bunch of lore. Try that quick cooldown I installed, so you can keep it. Oh, yeah! Nailed it! <clears throat> and, uh, thanks for the upgrade. All right, let's squeeze our way out of here. So, that thing we set free... Uh, what thing? I didn't see a thing. Uh, definitely don't want to talk about no thing. <laughs>